Good morning, good morning, good morning. Welcome back to the channel. This is Chris, the old school picker. Media was the name of the game yesterday on eBay. Let's see what we sold. All right, we'll give a little check-in on the momentum board. Yesterday, we took Kobe to the park yesterday and spent some time. I did go to the Goodwill and bought a couple of things. Bought this little camera for Polaroid camera for three dollars, and I bought this tur Ninja Turtle DVD. I have some more of these, so I may put this in with it. I don't know, but uh, I bought that I think for a dollar ninety nine. So yeah, it was pretty slim pickings. I didn't have my camera with me, so I didn't record. But it wouldn't have been a real great video anyways because I only bought two things. But, uh, so yeah, I got home yesterday and edited a video and, uh, kind of took the evening off. Um, I did list, uh, five items for $51 and yes, they were all on Macari. Um, and I am counting Macari on my momentum board because it's listings. So that's what I done yesterday. Uh, I did have, I think I've got seven going out today, so we'll pull those, um, several things of media actually so that was good all right we'll go ahead and start pulling the orders first order i had going out was a playstation 2 game that's always awesome and it is dance dance revolution and right there it is dance dance revolution extreme playstation 2 i would have had around a dollar in this and it sold for 5.95 Plus shipping. All right. Next order I had going out was a wrestling game. So that's awesome. You know I love selling wrestling games. And it's WWE 2K13. And I had two different ones. And I'm looking for number one. Sometimes if they're in a little different condition, I'll list them as individual items and I did this one WWE 2k13 and I will pull that little sticker it's actually inside the case so I'll pull it out and it sold for $7.95 plus shipping all right next order I had going out was some media so yay and I am looking for the price of freedom I believe it's that one right there El Precio del Sun one suno americano i hope i said that right but it's the price of the american dream that's what it is the american dream um and this of course is a viewer <laughs> sale so jessica thank you very much i hope you enjoy the dvd i appreciate your support so very much for not only my ebay but also my youtube channel so thank you jessica so very much i hope you enjoy the dvd and Jessica did write that she loves to hear the beep beep. So one more time. That's for you, Jessica. Next order I had gone out was this Star Wars uh, PC game. And it's called the Rebel Universe. Rebel Universe PC game. It's got the whatever you call that. I guess that's the hard drive. And then the floppy. Um pretty cool looking little game the manual alone is pretty cool i just picked this up at a yard sale last week and i think i paid a dollar for it and i listed it and took a best offer on it for 11 plus shipping so 11 dollars plus shipping and i had it less than a week so good little flip and the next order i had going out was one of these phones and i I picked these up. You see, I got three of them, but this is number one. And it's an RCA phone, office phone. And I did test them and they all worked. I picked all three of them up, I think, for $10 on the 127 sale. Um, and this this one sold for $49.95 plus shipping. And obviously, I will pack it way better than this, but. Just wanted to put it in that box so it was in the box ready to go so yeah $44.95 plus shipping and I got two more of them and I paid either I can't remember if I paid 10 or 15 for all three of them but it 
either way, it's a good deal. So $44.95 plus shipping. All right, next order I had going out was a Stephen King VHS. I have no idea where it's at because I don't even remember listing this, but obviously I did. And this is on the second account, by the way, the old school picker media vault. The Dark Half. Never heard of that movie, but it's a Stephen King movie based on the book by Stephen King. And I probably had around 50 cents in that. And it sold for $3.95 plus shipping. And to stay with Stephen King, I sold a Stephen King book. And proof right here that all Stephen King books are not worth buying. I, if you watch my channel, you'll know I sold two paperbacks. I think it was last week for around $10 to $15 for just the little paperback books. Well, this great big hardback book, you would think it was good, which I only paid 50 cents for it. But it only sold for $1.95, so not making much money on that. Just glad to get rid of it. All right, next order I had going out, I just had this come in, so I'm going to add it to this video. Is a Sims 2, PlayStation 2, or Sims busting out for the PlayStation 2. And that game sold for $4.95 plus shipping. And yes, I do have my beautiful wife hey guys. printing labels for me. So, gonna get those shipped out. And uh, that's all my video, uh, all my orders for this video. Not great, but not bad either. So, yeah, I'm glad to have them. I think that's seven total. So, should be some quick shippers. Um, Pretty much everything's media or video games. And no, I do not ship my video games media mail. Um, other than the phone, it should be easy to pack up. So, going to make it a short, shorter video today. Let me know in the comments below how your sales have been. Mine have been eBay roller coaster. Last two days were pretty good. Yesterday was eh, okay. So... Yeah, just the roller coaster continues. I think it's a lot of it is the time of the year we're at. Everybody's waiting on fourth quarter to get here, saving that money up. And of course, it is the end of the summer. So everybody's outside trying to do last minute things for the summer. So I think it's a lot of it's just the time of the year. My sales have not been horrible, not been bad. You know, I'm still chugging along. But nothing like they were a month ago. So, but that's eBay. That's selling online. Macari, I've got up to 19 listings, I think, something like that. I did sell the one yesterday or the day before. So, yeah, you know, I don't know. I shipped it out, no problem. Uh, so, we'll see how that goes. Hopefully, no problems. Hopefully, it goes good. So, uh, Macari is a lot easier to list on. But, I don't know that they have the customer base that eBay does. Well, I know they don't. So, <laughs> will I be a full-time Macari seller in the future? Probably not. But is it something that I can do? I do like listing the clothes on Macari is so much simpler than eBay. So, will most of my clothes in the future go on Macari? Yes, probably. Um... I probably will do the Macari account kind of like I do the second account on eBay. Media Vault, all my media or most of my media goes on that account. Well, I'll probably use Macari as another outlet for clothing. So that's what I've got in mind. Will I list some other stuff on Macari from time to time? Yeah, I will. But for right now, it's probably going to be all clothing. I do have the link to it. Uh, in the description below if you guys want to check it out. I know a couple of people messaged and said they were having a hard time finding it. So I did go on there and link it in uh, yesterday's video as well. So I will start adding it in the description below. So if you ever want to check it out. Along with my other two, e along with my two eBay stores. It's always, but don't ever feel obligated to buy anything. Uh, shout out to Jessica once again for purchasing the DVD. Thank you so very much. Um, but yeah, I don't ever feel obligated to have to buy anything, but I just put it in there because people want to check out and make sure you're who you say you are and you're selling what you say you're selling. 
and I get that. I understand that. That's part of YouTube. And I owe you guys that to be transparent, to let you know that what I say I'm selling, I'm selling. So I think that's only fair. If you're going to sit and watch, you should at least be able to check me out and verify that what I'm doing is, what I say I'm doing is what I'm actually doing. So yeah, I don't have a problem with that. Okay, today's Thursday, so post office closes at lunch, and it's already like 10.30, so I got to get to shipping this stuff. Um, been a little lazy the last couple of days. I think I wore myself out this past weekend on listing, so I've kind of took it easy the last couple of days, but I I'm still ahead on the momentum challenge, so I think if I can list 15 or 20 for the next three days each day, I'll stay ahead for the week. So 525, it's uh, it's doable. Will I do it? I don't know, but it is possible. And I've definitely got the inventory. It don't even look like I've touched those shelves. But trust me, I have. I've got some stuff inside the house that's ready to list and some stuff that's ready to take pictures. And then all this stuff right here on the table is ready to take pictures. So, And I've still got two shelfs back there. And around the corner, still a pile of stuff. So, plenty of stuff. So, thank you guys so very much for watching. Remember to comment, like, and subscribe. Leave in the comments below. Let me know how your sales have been going. Ring that notification bell to receive all notifications for when I upload a video. Old school picker.